On 22nd March, Indian Space Research Organization ISRO announced that it has successfully demonstrated free space quantum communication over a distance of 300 meters. According to ISRO, this is a major milestone for unconditionally secured satellite data communication using quantum technologies. With this breakthrough, India joins a handful of other nations such as US, UK, Canada, China and Japan who have made significant contribution in the field of quantum communication. Hello and welcome back to your own Jala Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Today we are going to discuss about ISRO's free space quantum communication and why it is so critical for Indian military. First, let's try to understand the importance of quantum communication. The cyber attack has become a new era weapon which, has, which can completely cripple down your opponent. Recently, Government of India has informed about 300% rise in cyber attacks in India in 2020. On 28 Feb 2021, a US-based agency Record Future reported that China-linked group Red Echo had targeted the Indian pass sector last year amid the ongoing tension between India and China at LSE. On February 21st, Hindustan Times reported that devices of multiple former defense personnel have been compromised in a phishing attack launched through similar attacks carried out by government domain email addresses. Last year again, the National Highway Authority of India reported a cyber attack on its email server and said prompt action was resulted in no data loss. It has to shut down its server as a precaution. There are numerous examples that we can keep on quoting. However, the bottom line of the story is that cyber threats are as real as any missile threat and even more deadly. The threat posed by cyber attackers is forcing governments, militaries and business to explore more secure ways of transmitting information. Today, sensitive data is typically encrypted and then sent across fiber optical cables and other channels together with digital keys needed to decode the information. The data and keys are sent as a classical bits, which is a stream of electrical or optical pulses represented as ones and zeros. And that makes them vulnerable. The smart hackers can read and copy the bits in transit without leaving a trace. Now let's try to understand how quantum communication is going to help. The quantum communication takes advantages of laws of quantum physics to protect the data. These laws allow particles, typically photons of light, for transmitting data along optical cables. If you consider light to be made up of small packets of energy, then the photons are that small packet. The photons can represent multiple combinations of ones and zeros simultaneously. These particles are known as quantum bits or qubits. The beauty of qubits from a cyber security perspective is that if a hacker tries to observe them in transit, their super fragile quantum state collapses to either 1 or 0, which means that a hacker cannot tamper the qubits without leaving behind a telltale sign of the activity. Some countries have taken advantage of this property to create a network for transmitting highly sensitive data based on a process called quantum key distribution or QKD. In theory, at least these networks are ultra secure. Now let's try to understand the ISRO's free space quantum communication test. So the good news is that ISRO has demonstrated their quantum capabilities by live video conferencing using quantum key encrypted signals. The free space quantum key distribution QKD was demonstrated at Space Application Center SAC Ahmedabad between two line of sight buildings within the campus. The experiment was performed at night to ensure there is no interference of direct sunlight. Most of the mission critical technologies used in experiments were built by ISRO in-house which includes Navic receiver for time synchronization between the transmitter and receiver modules and gimbal mechanism system instead of bulky large aperture telescopes for optical alignment. The quantum key distribution allows to generate 
and distribute a secret key which can be used to encrypt or decrypt a message. Thanks to quantum phenomenon like quantum entanglement, the presence of a third party between sender and receiver can be identified, hence the communication is always secure. The quantum key distribution QKD technology underpins quantum communication technology that ensures unconditional data security by the virtue of the principles of quantum mechanics which is not possible with conventional encryption system. The conventional crypto system used for data encryption rely on the complexity of mathematical algorithms whereas security offered by quantum communication is based on the laws of physics. Therefore. Quantum cryptography is considered as future proof since no future advancements in the computational power can break quantum crypto system, said ISRO in their statement. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this. I would like to say goodbye and jai hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.